the Dear Congo, located in Africa with an ancient history, is one of the birthplaces of civilization. Morocco, a North African country with a thousand years of history, where the famous four imperial cities still retain their original glory. My name is Merveille. I am Yasmina. Now we are in China, a great civilization in the East. It's here that we set off on our journey towards the 5,000 years old light of civilization. We are studying in Hangzhou, the capital city of Zhejiang province. Since coming to Hangzhou, many people have told me about a special place, Liangzhou. When I arrived to the archaeological ruins of Liangzhou city, what I saw left me speechless. This is a sacred place, which is evidence of the Chinese civilization, more than 5,000 years of history. And as a result, it was included on the World Heritage List in July 2019. So why do people find the Liangzhou civilization so fascinating? With this question in mind, I began to explore the history of Chinese civilization. Are you ready? Let's go! Liangzhou is called a miraculous civilization. You might be wondering why? This is a magnificent imperial city with highly developed rice growing practices, mysterious primitive religious rituals, sophisticated pieces of handmade craft work, and a gigantic water conservancy system. All of these amazed people from all over the world. So just how were the scientists able to judge that the archaeological ruins of Liangzhou city is really over 5,000 years ago? Kagusua it's hard to imagine that Liangzhou had built a water conservancy system 5,000 years ago. What's more incredible about that is that still remains of the dikes they constructed. Now, I'm going to visit one of them. Wow. Many people believe that the water conservancy systems in ancient Egypt were the earliest. However, due to the discovery of the archaeological ruins of Liangzhou city, people now know that the earliest such systems appeared in Liangzhou, Hangzhou. Liangzhou. The effective management of water is an important symbol of the development of civilization. Besides being able to manage water, the ancient Tianzhou people also used calendar. It is amazing to see that they observed and understood the changes each season brought. 农业产生就是必须要懂得立法，你必须对一年四季啊非常清楚。如果说错过了季节，这个庄稼就种不好。With the knowledge of climate change and water management, Yanzhou City had bumper harvest, enough for people to enjoy cooked rice, as it is the case with modern people. So here's the question: What did they use to cook rice? 脖子比较长的这种。还有一个是就是这个里边有一个灯两组时期他们开始一个蒸饭两组是一个稻作社会的一个顶级的时候所以对我们日本人来说还是两组是一个痴迷的文化就稻作文化的一个母亲一样的感觉 Yangzhou was the golden era of jade wear Look 
Jade songs like these have patterns too exquisite for the eye to differentiate. A pond measuring an area of 3-4 cm, archaeologists found that each millimeter has 5-6 lines. It is hard to imagine how the craftsmen 5,000 years ago were able to carve like this without the help of metal tools. It still remains a mystery. Jade was the symbol of power. Amongst the objects found at Qianzhou, jade ware makes up the biggest proportion with all kinds of jade objects found. These represent the Qianzhou people's social codes regarding belief and social hierarchy. 两种文化的很多的气力，既是神崇拜的时候，就是人用于沟通人神的不可缺少的这么一种媒介，它又同时又是啊成为人的社会等级身份地位标志的一种标尺。Through a series of discoveries, the archaeologists believe that Liangzhu is not only a center; its connection with the surrounding area could be regarded as a country. 原来我们以为是有一点文明的曙光，后面一看不对了，这么一大套系统，它没有个强有力的政权，它能做成吗？所以它一定是有个国家。About 5,000 years ago, mankind entered the country stage of civilization. Ancient Egypt, near the river Nile, Sumer in Mesopotamia, and Harappa, near the Indus River, all entered the country stage of civilization around that time. These discoveries at Yanju city prove that China also entered that stage around the same time. Now, Yanzhou has become one of the cultural landmarks of Hangzhou, as well as one of the city's treasures. The Yanzhou Museum and the archaeological ruins of Yanzhou City, etc., are all open to the public. Here, you can witness the light of civilization from 5,000 years ago. Welcome, welcome to Yanzhou, and welcome to Hangzhou. Hangzhou.